First is the Philips ODM business uh, that uh, we are doing. Uh, he mentioned about the Philips ODM business and I just want to emphasize on the fact that you know we are ODMs and we are not doing the commodity uh, products uh, because I know a lot of questions will be uh, towards uh, the business that we are doing uh, with Philips. Uh, we are not doing the commodity products like uh, you know the regular bulbs and uh, tube lights. We are doing the high-end home decorative lighting space uh, for them and we are the ODMs. Uh, so a lot of backward integration is involved. We do a lot of uh, uh, you know processes in-house to manufacture these products, uh, design these products. So you know emphasis on the design uh, part and. Uh, like Mr. Hardi mentioned, started with uh, just uh, you know two SKUs uh, in 2012, and today doing close to around uh, 600 SKUs, 600 odd SKUs. So that is the journey that we've had, uh, you know, with them, and uh, all the products that we are doing for them are all ODM products. Uh, so and that has been the strategy all along to bring in you know new uh, products, not just the products uh, to bring in new product lines, also product categories. Uh, and, and you know, at any given point of time, we have around 30 to 40 products uh, which are always under development, and that is that is our strength and the core strategy, uh, you know, behind uh, the growth uh, with them. And uh, apart apart from the Philips ODM division, uh, uh, like Mr. Hardy, you know, touched based on the different verticals that we are into. So. Uh, Refrigeration lighting is something that you know we started in uh, 2016. Uh, so by refrigeration, uh, you know, lighting and controls, we basically mean uh, the products for uh, the commercial refrigerators, the Coke and Pepsi fridges, the deep freezers, the busy coolers that you see uh, in the commercial refrigerator space. So we started this vertical in 2016, uh, and today we are associated with. Companies like Western Refrigeration, Frigo Glass, and a whole host of other companies who are into the manufacturing of these commercial refrigerators and busy coolers. Uh, so we started developing these uh, LED, uh, you know, modules, uh, the controllers for them. Uh, then recently we had developed the IPS stabilizer. So all the products that we are doing in this category, uh, we are basically doing, uh, you know, import substitution, and uh, we are, uh, you know, the only organized player. Uh, in this uh, segment and we are seeing very good uh, growth uh, in this uh, space and uh, like Mr. Hadeep mentioned, it's, it's, you know the products uh, are a bit complex, uh, require a lot of uh, technical know-how and an uh, and understanding plus the certifications are also required because our end customers uh, whom we are supplying these parts for their commercial refrigerators, they are not just selling these products in uh, India alone, they are also exporting. So hence, you know, the certification part uh, comes into play. It takes a lot of time to develop uh, and validate these products. Uh, so these are some of the, you know, products that we are doing for this category. Uh, like I mentioned the IPS stabilizer, fan motor controllers, the lights with accelerometers for the deep freezers. So these are some of the products uh, we do in this category. Uh, this we are doing in uh, one of the subsidiaries uh, of IP Lighting Limited, uh, which is Royal Lighting. Uh, and within Royal Lighting, uh, we are also doing uh, you know lights for uh, the uh, organized uh, retail uh, giants that are there, and we are supplying lights for their showroom uh, requirement. So this is something that we do. Uh, these two basically verticals are uh, being uh, you know handled in Royal Lighting. And apart from that, uh, we are also, uh, 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 like Mr. Hadi mentioned uh, about the export unit, uh, which we started in 2019. Uh, so uh, within the export unit, uh, we have two different uh, set of uh, you know, products. Again, one is the industrial products that we are doing for the US market that we started in 2019. Uh, uh, then due to COVID, uh, there was a slowdown, although we were still growing uh, during COVID as well. Uh, but now, uh, after COVID, we are seeing very good, uh, you know, uh, growth in that particular segment. And apart from that, the RV sector, uh, which we mentioned, uh, the recreational vehicles uh, that are pretty common uh, in the US. Uh, like, just to give you a reference, in 2021, around 600,000 RVs uh, were sold. So RVs are recreational vehicles like your, you know, uh, you all would be aware of the vanity vans that the film stars they carry here in Bombay. Uh, so it's like a one-bedroom apartment that you can hook up to your, uh, you know, pickup truck. 
So they are pretty common in the US. Uh, it's, uh, they, it has a, you know, a bedroom, a pantry, a washroom. So they carry it all along uh, the US for travel. So we are manufacturing you know, the indoor-outdoor lighting requirement for these products. Also the ABS pipes and fittings. And apart from that, uh, the uh, solar uh, panels and charge controllers. Only these products which I mentioned, the three categories, we are doing only for the recreational vehicles and not for any other market. So they have that specific requirement, uh, uh, you know, catering to this uh, market itself. So here also, uh, the, you know, the two subsidiaries that I just uh, mentioned, the Royal X Lighting and the Royal X Export, uh, we are seeing very strong growth in these verticals. Uh, and uh, uh, I mean, going forward, uh, we expect the numbers to continue to grow. And even the Philips business, uh, what we are doing, like I mentioned about the different you know, product lines and product categories, uh, we are expecting uh, good volumes, good growth from the, uh, consistent, you know, growth uh, in these uh, segments as well. And uh, lastly, just wanted to, uh, you know, mention about uh, our captive unit, uh, which is uh, by the name of uh, Fine uh, Technologies. So within the captive unit, we are basically supplying the semi-finished goods to all other various units, and that is, I would say, our backbone uh, of, of the businesses that we are doing. It is supplying semi-finished goods like the casings, the hardware, you know, all powder coated and ready to be assembled. So, uh, and that is one of our major strengths and the reason why, uh, you know, we are able to generate uh, these numbers and profits. And going forward, uh, the capex that we are planning, uh, we are planning to expand our production capabilities that we are expanding our tool room. We even, you know, design and develop our tools also in-house. And then uh, we are you know, expanding a lot on the fixture manufacturing side of things, the aesthetics, uh, because that is something uh, that you know, will remain a, a very strong area for us. And uh, obviously the driver side also, like we design and develop the electronics uh, and everything in-house. Uh, so these are the areas where we are expanding and uh, where the major part of the, you know, the KPEX is going to uh, go. So that basically sums up uh, the businesses and the different verticals uh, that we have. Uh, anything that I have missed out? Uh, yeah, I was just. Uh, <coughs> I would just uh, like to add to what Sindhi just mentioned that in the refrigeration side, uh, we are manufacturing. I, I think uh, if I tell you this, you would be able to relate all the lights for the Coke and Pepsi uh, commercial refrigerators that you see across the markets. So uh, right now we are supplying to all the players in India but since like Sanjeet mentioned it takes almost 2 to 3 years to get these products certified. So we are even looking at the European markets and the American markets to export this product as well because right now only uh, probably China and Thailand are two countries who are manufacturing these kind of refrigeration lights and we see a huge potential because these four Pepsi fridges they see their usage uh, worldwide. So, you know, we are trying to export these uh, lights also as these lights are already certified. And uh, secondly, I would just like to add a bit on the uh, commercial lighting segment. We are basically, 10 years back we started uh, sub, uh, giving lighting solutions to all the retail stores that you see in the mall. So, we are very different from other players who are present in this market because we give them the complete lighting solution. We tell them that, you know, what should be the light to light distance, what should be the color temperature of the light, what should be the CRI of the light to get the true color of the object. We are the only ones in India who are manufacturing our own drivers in this particular segment because as you know that in India, there are the voltage fluctuations are there. So, our design, our drivers, uh, basically pass a surge capacity of 4.4 kV. So we help all the stores in designing of the lights basically. So I think this is all uh, that we wanted to say and we are looking for the export segment also in this particular field.